In early October 1863, the defeated Union Army trudged into Chattanooga, frustrated at their recent defeat at Chickamauga. Meanwhile, the victorious Confederates claimed the heights of Lookout Mountain over the city and prepared to lay siege. From this vantage point, Confederate artillerists could control the flow of Union supplies on the roads at the foot of Lookout Mountain, the rail lines, and the Tennessee River. On October 5, 1863, the Confederate artillery opened fire on the Union batteries on Moccasin Bend. Down below, the boom of cannon echoed as Confederate shells rained down on the frustrated Union soldiers. By November, number, number of troops stationed right out here in this. But soon, they returned to fire and the tide began to turn. Fire! From Moccasin Bend, Union gunners could cover the face of Lookout Mountain and keep the Confederates at arm's length away from their comrades in the city. The roads on Lookout Mountain became traps for any Confederates attempting to move across them. For the Union Army, frustration quickly turned to hope and eventual victory. For the Confederates, hope turned to frustration as they realized that Moccasin Bend was the key to Chattanooga.